Motion Bank is a project by William Forsyth, who is a well-known choreographer, the Fraunhofer IGD and the HFG Offenbach. Basically, they let different dancers perform to the score No Time to Fly by Deborah Hay and they collected about 4 terabyte of tracking data. So, in the next step, this data was provided to students who were able to remix it in their own way into different kind of visualizations. Mainly, we've got information about the position of the dancers in 3D space. With this information, we could calculate the speed, the motion path and the time of each performance. Also, we read the score and try to understand the intentions and motives for each scene. In our translation, we primarily focused on the moods that were described in the scenes. We picked up three scenes and interpreted them in our own way of the visualization. Firstly, when we heard about the Oculus Rift, we were excited to see the vast amount of possibilities this technology would let us access. We love games and the Oculus Rift take this experience to a next level. But we wanted to try another way of usage and end up with an interactive movie where your user, the user can choose his own point of view in a spherical panorama. It should be noted that we are not that happy about the fact that Facebook acquired Oculus Rift but we will see what they are going to come up with. We used Cinema 4D to build and animate our own world. It took quite a long time to model these objects and texture them, but in the end we got a pretty decent result. The tracking data was imported with a self-written Python script which affected position, the movement and other parameters like particle systems and physical calculations of our objects. So, for the rendering we used V-Ray because it allows the possibility to create a spherical panorama without any intermediate steps. Two cameras with about 8cm offset were exported to create a stereoscopic 3D. Fortunately, displaying the movie inside the Oculus Rift was not a problem at all. Luckily, the VR player by Stefan Levesque handles this task easily. In the end, we showed our film in the exhibition Design Blick. We had a blast looking at the different reactions of the visitors. At the start, they were not aware of the fact that they could look around in all directions. But after that, they were pretty excited to explore the world we created. All in all, the feedback was very positive coming from younger and older people. It was a special experience for both them and us.